Well hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. Now today we're um, doing another in the series of um, the motorcycle clubs in Hawke's Bay and uh, today we're off to Hastings and uh, we're going to have a look at Hawke's Bay Harley MC. Okay, hi guys, and uh, welcome back to the channel. Uh, once more, you're with Goose, and this gentleman sitting beside me is Rick. And uh, Rick, I'll get you to introduce yourself if you if you would. Uh, my name's Ricky Joe. People just call me Rick, and I'm the current president of the Hawke's Bay Harley Club. Now, this isn't to be confused with Hog. This is a like the no Hawke's Bay no. Harley Motorcycle Club. Okay, yeah. and you're separate. Separate and, and from Hawksbub, Hawk. you're not a part of a chapter of another. No. Okay. Just strictly Hawks Bay Harley. Oh, brilliant. Yep. Brilliant. Okay. So, how long have you been going? Um, the club's been going since 2000. Yep. And um, I've been a member of the club now just over nine years. Yep. Um, had a few friends that were members, and I, I really like the fundraising aspect of it. Yep. So um, they encouraged me to join and. Sort of have a look back, really. Okay. Yeah. The rest is history. The rest is history. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Yeah, that's all good. Yeah. So, what's the strength of the club at the moment? Um, we've got two dozen members. Yep. So we, yep. Um, COVID has played a big part in things where we weren't allowed to ride. Yep. So everyone's sort of realised that there's a bit more to life than just riding. Yep. But um, in saying that, they're all starting to come back now that the um, COVID is sort of sort of diminishing, and we can we can get out and ride a bit more now. Yeah. So I'm looking forward to this year. Yeah, I think it's going to be good for not just Hawks Bay Harley, but for every club out there. Yeah, that's the, the comment I've heard from a few people. People have, have, with the COVID, have the enthusiasm seems to have dropped back a bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it did. Yeah, it was. Yeah. yeah, it played a big part the COVID. Yeah, but um, it's coming back. Yeah, It'll come back. Yeah, cool. Yeah. Now you mentioned the the um, charity work and the fundraising. Tell, yes. us, tell us a bit about that. What does what um, Hawks Bay Harley do? We we fundraise for the Acorn Project Hawks Bay. Yep. Um, first, I think two thousand nine was when when the club first started fundraising. Yep. I wasn't a member then. Um, I think they did little lounges and and and. Yep. Uh, canteen was a big part as well. Okay. Yep. Um, hence why we do the Acorn Project was just a follow on of Canteen. Yeah. Um, they shut their doors on Kerry and the kids here. Big no for us. Yep. Don't do that. No. no. <laughs> they need that hands-on support. Yeah. Not just a telephone call. Yeah. Right. So um, we were there for Kerry, and I'm glad she's she's cracked it. Yep. So to speak. Yeah, it's fantastic. Yeah. So um, we do that, and then during the year we'll take the kids out. We'll, we'll supply them lunch. We might take them out. Last year, last time we took them out to Waimarama and okay. had a barbecue and made burgers oh. and took oh, them brilliant. for a ride, and yeah. we do that every year. Yep. It's just something we can give back to the kids, and, and it's nice to have a bit of fun. Yep. They can get on the back of the bikes. <laughs> We're not allowed to go fast, eh? <laughs> Of course not. <laughs> we get asked lots by the kids, can we please go fast? But we're not allowed. Yeah. We won't tell them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but no, it's a fantastic day. It really, really is. Yeah. It, yeah. It's just something that we can give, because we're so lucky that we can do these things. Yeah, you bet. Yeah. yeah. Very yeah, we lucky. Are. We, are, we are absolutely blessed. We've got the machinery with the time. Yeah. And and the other thing, we've got the inclination to be able to do it too. Yes. Yeah. 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 Because yeah. um, some of these kids, we, you know, I've been doing it as I say, I'm nine years now, and every year there's one or two kids that aren't there. Yeah. The following year. Yeah. And that that's what keeps us going with it. It's, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. That's not, yeah. No, that that gets a. Yeah, occasionally you'd have a bit of dust in the eye, I would think. Oh, definitely. Yeah. yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Especially when you don't see them, and you, you, they were on the back of your bike last year. Yeah. And you got a, you made a bit of a connection, and you, you look for them. Yep. You know, yeah. where are they? Where are they? And they're not there. They're not there. Yeah. And it's oh man, really? <laughs> yeah. That's so cruel. Yeah, it is. It, mm. it is. Yeah. No. Oh, that's that's really really good. So you. How did you actually get tied up with the, the Acorn project? We say it was a follow-on from Canteen? Yep, when I joined the club, the uh, the club sponsored Canteen. Yeah. Um, and in 2019, Kerry got a phone call just before Christmas, which I thought was a bad time, um, saying that Canteen were closing the doors on all their um, provincial town, all the, all the towns, yep. and just kept Auckland, Wellington and Christchurch. Okay. And 
it just didn't didn't go down too well with us. So she's rung us, said she had an idea, and um, we were there. We were great support right from from day dot. Cool. We wanted her to carry on because we'd seen how Kerry works. Yep. And she's absolutely fantastic with these kids and their families, which we just wanted it to carry on. Yep. Yeah. It's oh, been great. marvelous, mate. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. good. No, oh, cool. Okay, now if I wanted to join Hawks Bay Harleys. What do I have to do? Do I have to have a Harley for a start? And well, not necessarily. Some of our members have tribes, yep. um, victories, anything American, pretty much Indian. Yep. Um, but Harleys is, uh, is, is well, of yep. course, Hawks Bay Harley. Hawks Harley, yep. um, But not not necessarily a Harley. Yep. Um, and to join, talk to one of our members, ring, yep. either ring me or one of the committee members, and say, hey, I wouldn't mind joining. Um, we do a, a club ride every third Sunday. Cool. And this Friday will be the start of our Friday night rides, which we will do every second week. Okay. So we um, we say to these guys, you know, come for a ride, do three rides with us, and if you gel with us, you're more than welcome to join. Come and have a look, yeah. Yeah, come and have a look, do yep. three rides, get to meet the club members, Yep. and if, if, as I say, if you get on and you ride well, yep. respect us, yes. yeah, you, you're more than welcome to join. Cool. Yeah. No, that's good. And you're what's referred to as a front patch club you're not a back patch club not a back patch club. no 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 we're not there for that no, at no all. good yeah, yeah at all good, good social club <laughs> we <yeah>. don't do it <laughs> no. yeah. no. that, that's brilliant because it's one of the things that will either encourage some riders or, or put them off yeah is, is yep. now we've got go. like a hundred pictures on our jackets yeah <laughs> not one <laughs> yeah. Yeah. exactly yeah exactly. but we like it that way yeah it, it, it shows the support for all the other clubs in the, in That's the it. Yeah, you've got it. They're not sure, just supporting you. You support them as well. Yep, Auckland. Yep. We know we, we support Wanganui, all clubs all over the country. Yeah, if we can get there. Yes, <laughs> if, if you can get. That's the main. Yeah, thing. Yeah. yeah. No, that's I really good. To. Yeah. Okay. Well, that sort of pretty much covers um, where we're at. What the club is all about. But you got anything else you want to add um, at all, Eric? No, not really. No. Not that's really. Sort of cover what it is. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So when did you start riding and what was your first bike? Me, um, I started riding when I was about, well, hard riding when I was about 11. Okay. Yeah. Um, we lived out at Kahuranaki Station. My dad was a shepherd out there. All right. And the neighbour across the road, I used to babysit his children. And he was with the Hawke's Bay Motorcycle Club. Right. He rode trials. So he asked me one day, because I used to, my grandfather gave me a motorbike to do my possum trapping. Yep. And the neighbour across the road asked me if I'd teach his son how to ride. And I said, yeah, that'd be great. <laughs> and he lent me a TL125. All oh, right. <laughs> so that, that, that carried on. And then um, he asked me if I wanted to come and do a trial ride within one weekend. So, yep. And I, I just stuck. You were I hooked. loved it. I loved it. Yeah. So I rode for three years. Rode the North Island Champs when I was 13. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely got it. Um, so I had a TL125 then, then upgraded to a Montessa 348. And That's the name I haven't heard for a while. Yeah, Montessa. okay. Yeah. yeah. And then I started getting into trail bike riding as well. And um, I think the worst thing was we moved to town. <laughs> and all I had was a drain to ride up and down. <laughs> A drain of all things. <laughs> Better than nothing. <laughs> well, it was actually. <laughs> yeah. Made a mess of the drain. <laughs> <laughs> well, it wasn't growing weeds anyway. No, it was, it was clean. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I started getting, once I got my license, then I was off. Yeah. I was got into my XR 600s and had quite a few of those. And, yeah. But um, I worked at the works and uh, a dear friend, Mother Goose, Ron Walters, had a, oh, right. had a, had a, um, a custom soft tail, 1340. Okay. And I pestered him and hounded him, please, Goose, can I have a ride? And he finally gave in, and I fell in love with it. I just absolutely loved the way they rode, oh, the talk of them. Yep. And I knew in my heart I had to get one. That's it. So that's, <laughs> yep. We finally did get one a few years later, and Lindy and I, we shipped it to Perth and brought our first bike over there. Cool. And, yeah. Yeah. Brought it home. And, haven't looked back. Yep. Still got it. Oh, brilliant. Yeah, still got the old girl. She's a yellow heritage soft tail. Oh, right. <laughs> Everyone knows the yellow heritage soft tail. Everyone does. <laughs> Watch my videos. <laughs> yeah. Quite often on all these rides. Yep. Yep, definitely. No, that's brilliant, mate. Hmm. No, that's good. So it's quite a, quite a long career you've had. Yep. Not saying you're old. but <laughs> uh, Just the grey hair. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. But um, the, the thing I do like about it is my family are, are really interested in motorcycles as yeah. well. 
that's that's really yeah. choice, isn't it? That's really where you want it. Yeah, my yeah. son's riding today. My my partner's riding her own, but she's got a twelve hundred sports and She's doing fantastic with her riding. And yeah, I, I, I really enjoy that. Yeah. That means I can keep going. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know how that feels, actually. Yeah. 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 So I won't be not riding ever. Yeah. That's it. Mm. Yeah. Like me, my old universal joints here don't work that well, so I'm on the three wheels instead of two, and that's what, as long as you're riding, it's. Yeah. Yeah. That's, yeah, that's definitely. yeah. Definitely. Yeah. That's no, all cool. Mm. Okay, buddy. Well, thank you so much for your time. Oh. And, um, and, no, and for the cup of tea and, and, yeah, and, and your thanks for the, Thanks for the <laughs> uh, short break. Yeah. Well, don't tell them that. They'll all want one when I interview them. <laughs> Right. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Mm. So there you go, folks. Hawke's Bay Harley. Um, if you're thinking about joining a club in Hawke's Bay or if you're new into Hawke's Bay, um, give these guys a ring. Now, you've got a um, Facebook page? We have a Facebook page, yes. Okay. Yes. Yep. Give these a look for the Hawke's Bay Harley MC Facebook page and message um, the guys. The messages will come through to Rick um, or to his um, senior members, and they'll get in touch with you. Um, but they're a great club to ride with, though, as you can um, have just uh, heard they do a heck of a lot of good work in the community but there's a lot of social rides that they do on their own as well as so um, looking for a club give them a try and see how you go but in the meantime thanks for watching don't forget to ride free and of course god bless <laughs>